Now that we've learned about mechanical, chemical, and biological weathering, let's discuss erosion. Erosion is the movement of sediment from one place to another. There are four main agents of erosion that we'll look at today. Glaciers, gravity, wind, and water. Glaciers are areas of permanent ice and snow. Glaciers slide downward due to their weight and gravity. As they flow, glaciers carry sediment and rocks with them that are frozen within the ice. When glaciers melt, the rocks and sediment are dropped in a whole new area. Gravity can move sediment as well, such as from the top of a mountain to the bottom. Wind is an agent of erosion as it blows sediment all around. Often, people plant trees to act as a windbreak to keep the soil in a field from eroding away. Water is the last agent of erosion we'll look at today. Water, especially moving water, is a very strong force. Sediment is often carried down rivers and streams to new areas. Because erosion is moving sediment around, it can change what the earth looks like. Erosion can change the surface of the earth either suddenly or gradually. For example, receding ocean cliffs are gradually eroding away versus a rock slide that causes sudden change. Rocks and sediment were on a mountain top and now they fill the valley. Through weathering and erosion, a rock in one area can break into sediment and move to a whole new area where it then might form a completely new rock.